Okay, let's try this again. This is my attempt to record a playthrough of one of my old ZZT games, which has become sort of a meme on the Google Plus in the past couple of days. Uh, the game that I've chosen is Llama Masters 2, because I loaded up Llama Masters 1 earlier today, and I found that it was not really very interesting, and uh, there wasn't, wouldn't have been a lot for me to talk about. So, hopefully, I haven't actually played through this one in probably at least a decade, so I don't really remember uh, whether it'll be any better, but hopefully it will. A little bit of background, Llama Masters is a uh, comic that I drew with some of my friends when I was in middle school, which uh, at the time Power Rangers was a big thing, and it was kind of a parody of that, and also kind of incorporated elements from our lives and, you know, whatever was going on in school, and basically we took our uh, teen angst and turned it into ridiculous comic book villains and stuff like that. And then I made a ZZT game out of it. So, the Great Llama, who is the Zordon stand-in of this game, is beckoning me. And delivers a bunch of exposition. I guess I'll just go ahead and read this. Greetings. As you know, much has changed since your first encounter with Mac Daddy. For instance, the White Llama has left to become Weber, but we now have two new llamas, JJ and Firebrand. They will be invaluable to your success in your next mission. You see, Mac Daddy has been re revived by Miranda, the ex-Purple Llama, who also brought Leonard, the ex-Red Llama, back. And they're both madder than ever. Your mission is to stop them. I will give you health and ammunition. Now go. Oh, wait! It seems that now that Mac Daddy is back, many normal people and animals have turned evil. If you encounter anyone like this, you must turn them back to normal by defeating them in a battle. The trick to Mac Daddy's spell is that if they lose fair and square, the spell is broken. If, however, you encounter someone or something that is evil through and through without the spell, you must just destroy it. Okay, I really am finished. Oh, wait! I just remembered. Brandon, the Yellow Llama, will not be accompanying you on your mission. He is getting Booter's wings clipped, but Booter doesn't want to cooperate. Uh, yeah. Well, that's a lot of needless uh, backstory of things that happened uh, in the comics that don't matter. I'm gonna go and talk to my fellow llamas. Hi, I want to give you this. It is a big bar of deodorant. I don't know if you'll need this, but I want you to have it anyway. I know you've needed it for a long time. I don't know if you'll need this, but you've needed it for a long time. Okay, well, uh, I remember at the time I had been playing a lot of Earthbound, and um, I think a lot of the dialogue and stuff in here sort of affects the style of that localization. My name used to be Ryan, but now it's Beats. Pointless, huh? Anyway, our first major enemy will be Weber himself. He's mad because he killed me and got expelled, so now he's turned evil. We'll have to knock some sense into him. Nya he he, I'm Firebrand. I have Firepipe. Nya nya roast him. Nya yeah, he, that character is supposed to be a pyromaniac. I'm JJ. I'm new. I'm supposed to be the Peach Llama, but because of the color limitations of ZZT, oops, I mean the world, I look yellow. Oh man, breaking the fourth wall there. Oh, I guess I accidentally talked to Firebrand there. Hehe, <laughs> I could roast this whole web, but it might kill us. Should I try it? No. It's me, Beats. I noticed that some parts of this big web seem weak to the touch, but not so weak you can just walk through, if there was some way to break them. In case you didn't know, this is Weber's web. It's like a maze. We will have to get through, but the web strands are almost as strong as steel. As far as I can tell, there's no way out. However, if we could blast through the wall or something, nah, it wouldn't work. Hints.
There's a weak section. You can tell that it's weak because it doesn't uh, mesh perfectly with the other line segments. That's because it's an object and not a piece of line or whatever this stuff is called. I can't remember. Oh. Oh wow. I didn't even have to do anything. My teammates killed all those whatever they were. <laughs> I'm probably gonna get killed. See, I get killed a lot. Ugh. Oh yeah. Beats was uh, sort of the Kenny of Llama Masters. I believe this was before there was a Kenny, so really they ripped me off. I hate spiders. Give me bug spray. No spray? No way! <laughs> These are Weber's hench spiders. They can spit at you. Well, they're dead, but... Disgusting, but at least we have some light. Good point. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention that uh, last room was... That was the ZZT darkness, where you have to use a torch and it puts a little circle of visibility around you. You probably figured that out, but... And here's the, the first boss, Weber. Surrounded by tigers for some reason. Tigers are the, the pie symbols that shoot at you. Because, you know, that's what tigers do. See, I cleverly uh, killed that tiger next to the duplicator here, so he can't spawn anymore. Weber has a weak spot on his stomach. See that part that's not as hairy as the rest? Aim for it. Thanks. Oops. <laughs> well, I missed that dialogue, as happens frequently in ZZT games. I'm caught in his web! Sorry, dude. Ha ha, I broke his arm. Ha ha, can spiders make new arms? I don't believe they can. I don't know about this. He doesn't seem to be taking any damage. What's the problem? Well, I already killed him, for one thing. Uh, so why is the door not opened? I see the light. Yeah, 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 for I am your very own Josh Wilson. I'm back to my normal webby self. Thanks, I'll give you this key. You're welcome. Okay, well, I already got the key. Uh, hmm. It seems like I should probably be able to get past this door, but I don't seem to be able to... So I just cheated to get rid of it. Black Llama, come here. Good work on turning Weber back to normal, but you probably found him very easy. Well, your next enemy won't be so easy. I have located Leonard! Now you will have to fight him. There is no guarantee that if you defeat him he will be permanently destroyed, but you have to try. Did you hear the news? We get to fight Leonard already. This is going to be easy. Leonard is such a wimp. Don't underestimate Leonard. He looks powerful, and he is. And remember, even if we defeat him, there are still many more enemies, including Miranda and Mac Daddy. Toast him. I toast Leonard. Burn him to a crispy critter. Nya ha ha. Yay, I beat Weber, and you oo didn't. Ha ha ha. Actually, I did. This passage will take you directly to Leonard's lair. Fight well, Great Llama. I guess I didn't feel like uh, making a level leading up to Leonard. Okay. I don't 
remember how to fight this guy, but I guess I'll figure it out. Ha ha ha, so you've come to try to beat me, eh? Well, I'm really powerful. Ha ha. You'll never beat me. Ha ha. Pashao, pashao, pashao. Puta, puta, puta. Ha ha. I have an impenetrable, no, an impenetratable shield around me. <laughs> By the way, how do you like my fire hair? It's my prized possession. Ha ha. Ah, uh, see. Even at 12 years old or whatever I was when I made this game, I knew how to, uh, hint at what you should do to beat things. Man, this is running really slowly all of a sudden. Well, that's kind of annoying, but I guess I will deal with it. Put on my sunglasses. It probably can't handle this volume of tigers. The, the processor just can't keep up. I was being sarcastic just then, by the way, in case you couldn't tell. I'm taking a bunch of hits, but it doesn't really matter because the game gives you a ridiculous amount of health. Yeah, so I believe the trick to this guy is to just destroy all of his hair because it's his prized possession. Yeah. My hair! You extinguished my hair, now I'm bald. Okay, fine. You win this time, but next time you're dead meat. Oh yeah, I guess I should explain. Leonard is uh, just based on some guy that we knew and didn't like um, and he had red hair so in the comic it, that became his head was on fire oh I like that little uh, effect um, his smile turned into a frown I guess I should talk to these guys ag his hair is made of fire I'm getting burned even though it's gone You know, the, the scripting in ZZT was limited, so uh, it it's hard to make a lot of different responses for, you know, varying conditions. Must break shield, da. Also, I was like 12 and didn't know what I was doing. It looks like he's right, I can't get through the shield, let me try something. And what's he trying? <laughs> it didn't work. <laughs> Controls for Leonard. Oh man, <laughs> he was a robot? Er, um, uh, pay no attention to that ex llama behind the curtain. Ah, forget it. It's too late now. I'll let you go this time. Here, take this portal back to your base. That's Miranda. So yeah, I guess uh, Leonard was a robot, and that wasn't the real one, so he'll probably come back later or something. I don't know. I don't remember. Ha, ah, you fool. You actually believed that I would let you go. Take this. Oh no. She killed the Great Llama. Ag. Ha ha ha. And she took his place. Now you will die. I am in control of the llamas. Attack! And may I present the ghost llama? You will have to fight him later. Without the help of your fellow llamas. In fact, they will be attacking you. Oh no. Ah, uh, what's going on? Oh. I am the ghost llama. Prepare to meet your doom. Oh man, the ghost llama. Okay, what am I doing here? Ah! She claims bullets don't even hurt her at all. I guess that's true. Okay, how do I <laughs> beat this? this thing over here. Y 
Yeah, I don't remember how to beat this. I wonder if she was lying about bullets not hurting her. They don't seem to be doing anything to the other llamas either. She claims I'm just wasting my time, and yet she keeps having different messages. that message too, but apparently she was lying, and bullets did hurt her. That's kind of lame, I, I shouldn't have made it do that. I'm back to normal now, but how do we get out of here? Man, what happened? It was like I was hypnotized. You were. Heh <laughs> heh, yeah, I went crazy, yeah, nya ha ha. These things are really uh, meant to be read in like a beavis voice, but I don't want to do that. That was strange. I kind of feel... I feel kind of like dizzy. I need to sit down. Maybe now this thing will do something. Yes. You weirdly touched the weird thing. For some weird reason, the way to the weird passage was weirdly opened. Yeah, so... My games uh, were never that good or uh, popular, but I think... The appeal that they did have was probably because they had just goofy crap like that dialogue, or narration, I guess. Has a certain quirky charm, I suppose. Now that was a strange experience. Oh, greetings, Black Llama. When Miranda took over me, I totally lost control. I am sorry I turned the other llamas against you. I was under Miranda's evil power. Although you have defeated Miranda in that battle, she is still at large and very powerful. It will be harder to defeat her than I thought. Anyway, when I was under Miranda's control, I was able to eavesdrop on her telephone conversation with Mac Daddy. Here's what I heard. So, how's the plan going? Great, I've taken control of the llama's leader. With your ghost llama, they're sure to be dead meat. Good, see to it that it happens that way. They're not as dumb as they look. Yeah, yeah, they beat Leonard twice already, remember? I know all about the stupid powers they have. I know, but I am sending a ton of mon monsters all over the place to slow them down, at least. The first that they will have to face is my hideous blob of goop. You don't want to know where it came from. Sounds like a great monster. Well, I gotta go now, because this is long distance and I have to kill the llamas. Did you listen to the great llama? When we beat the ghost llama, Miranda gave up and stopped controlling him. Miranda and Mac Daddy were talking on the phone, and it seems that now that we have... Now we have to fight something called a blob of goop or something. Yeah, I picked up on that. I hope I don't get killed in this battle. I really hate getting killed. Yeah, ha ha, goop, catch fire, and yeah, yeah. Even though I'm the peach llama, I'm not actually fuzzy like a real peach. Uh, sorry for laughing at my own stupid... Yeah. I wanted to tell you something, but I forgot what it was. Something about a glob of goop. Is it... Glob of goop or blob of goop? Seems inconsistent. Uh, something about a glob of goop surrounding the base, so we'll have to come out fighting, or something like that. Ugh. So, <laughs> apparently I just threw in a bunch of the uh, built in ZZT ruffians and bears. I probably don't need to actually bother with... Oh, there's some lions to uh, bother with killing these guys, but whatever. Haha, ha, I got here before you. I'm so awesome. Whatever you say, Mr. Big Head. Shut up! Oh, Beats is over here just hiding in the corner. Drat, you caught me. I think I'll just sit here until this whole thing blows over. 
Man, this thing is swarming with bugs and vermin. I don't want to know what it is. Oh, I see there's an actual thing over here shooting stars at me. I hate stars. Why did I put those in? I'm just gonna play recklessly and cheat if I need to. Splat, burp, belch, florp, splort. Eh, I won. Yeah, and not bug me shooting. Okay. Oops. Yeah, so the way that these Llama Masters games work, if you haven't picked up on it already, is basically you go to the Llama base and talk to the Great Llama, and then you go out and fight a boss, and then repeat. Good job defeating the Blob of Goop. You have won four major battles so far, but the war is far from over. I will give you supplies to help you on your way. You must now face Mac Daddy's lunch. He went on a diet just so he could try to kill the llamas. His lunch <laughs> consists of the big salad and the hot live pretzel. Uh, okay, so the big salad is obviously a reference to the Seinfeld episode, The Big Salad, in which some a salad that is big and is frequently referred to as the big salad is an important plot point. And the hot live pretzel, I believe, is from a David Letterman sketch that I saw one time that apparently made a big impression on me. I've never been able to find it since, but it involved, I don't know, somebody ordered a hot live pretzel and it, they got a pretzel and it sort of squirmed around in their hand and it was gross. And I, I don't know, I guess that sort of disturbed me and I put it in a game. Uh, hold on, I'm just plugging in my power cable here. Okay. Uh, this is the first time you have t faced two major enemies at once, so I hope you are prepared. To get to the big salad and hot live pretzel, you must fight through a bunch of chives. <laughs> Keep your energy up when fighting them so you will have plenty of health when fighting big salad and hot live pretzel. I have a feeling I just wanted to get the phrases big salad and hot live pretzel in there as many times as possible. There's a rumor that Miranda is trying to make a new body for Leonard. If you remember, when we fought him, he was just a head. I do remember. I really didn't do anything when we were fighting the Blob of Goop, and now I'm starting to feel guilty. Oh, man. See, this game is full of character development. Yeah, I eat salad for lunch. Yeah, yeah, ha, ha, ha. Remember when Josh was the White Llama? He was always eating that bobbly sauce stuff. That's going to be big trouble for him one day. Oh man, foreshadowing. Yeah, these are the chives, apparently. They look like centipede heads, but no, they're chives. Oh, I think Beats just got killed. Somehow. Whoa, cool, we're on a bridge going over a huge plate of lettuce. Thanks for explaining that. I would not have guessed that that was the case. I never put a lot of uh, effort into my graphics, obviously. Some people were, were really into using the uh, S tool K and uh, making fancy, you know, colorful graphics, but I could never really be bothered. Sorry, just taking a drink. Firing frenzy, get out of my way before I accidentally kill you. Yeah. So that's what happened to all, all the other llamas, because they can't actually be hurt by the chives. Okay, here's the big salad and the hot live pretzel. Now, I don't... Oh, wait. <laughs> Looks like there's a crack in the salad bowl there. Ah, stop killing me. Since I didn't help fight the glob of goop, I'm fighting twice as much as usual now. Unfortunately, you're wasting your bullets on a wall that does nothing. Okay, the crack in the big salad is getting wider each time I shoot it. Well, not each time, but eventually it does.
Uh, or maybe four inches wide is as wide as it gets. Huh. Oh. Ah. Yeah, here's where the uh, earthbound stuff comes in again. The heat of battle was too much for Beats. The heat of battle was too much for Adam. The heat of battle was too much for JJ. The heat of battle increased Firebrand's power. Beats fell to the ground unconscious. Adam fell to the ground unconscious. JJ fell to the ground unconscious. Firebrand's strength is increased by two. Firebrand's strength is maxed out. See, none of that actually is uh, representing anything happening in the game. I just wrote out all of that text to make it sound RPG-like. Just gonna run away from these stars until the next thing happens. The hot live pretzel's eyes fell out. The hot live pretzel turned into the stone cold dead pretzel. Oh no. Well, and there goes somebody. Who is that? Oh, it's Leonard. Oh man, Mac Daddy's not gonna be happy about this. He went on a diet to let you fight this stuff. If he finds out this food went to waste, he'll kill me. That's it. I'm gonna take you apart right here, right now, baby. Get ready for my Super Ultra Mambo Tango Foxtrot Martial Arts. That's more uh, Earthbound quoting there. If I, uh, oh, I've got a body now, and I don't even care if you extinguish my hair, because I've got a lighter. Bring it on, fat boy. Go off the top of the screen, duh. There's usually an exclamation mark after the boss's name, but apparently the programmer forgot to put them on this board. I'm substituting. I just like talking to all these guys uh, because I always enjoyed talking to people in games, so I tried to write amusing things for people who bothered to talk to them. Not always amusing, but... Ah, ha 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 I've got a new body and a shield. I'm unbeatable. The shield protects my weak points. My arms, legs, shoulders, and my uh-huh. Ha 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 ha. Give up now, llamas. My thuggies will kill you while you pointlessly try to break through the shield. Well, forget it. It won't work. Oh man, is he bluffing again? Probably not, because this shield looks like uh, actual indestructible walls. And there are a bunch of bombs here. So I probably need to use them. Ugh. <laughs> Ugh, crap. Oh, okay. Yeah, I believe there is a weak point at each of the places that he mentioned. Hopefully I can bomb them all. Now that I'm no longer in any danger, since all the ruffians are dead, Hmm. Are there more? Yeah, I guess I need to get the shoulders as well. You've hit my weak points. I've been defeated. Ah, I'll be right back. I mean, I'll be back right now. Excuse me while I get knocked out. Ugh, I'm knocked out. Help, help, it's me, Weber. I was just opening a packet of bubbly sauce, and suddenly it, it talked to me. It said, hey, tear open somebody else's head. I swear I heard it. And then, and then comes the crazy part. It grew arms, legs, and wings, and flew out the window. I, I I saw it growing when it went out. By the time I find it, it'll be huge. Like, really big. You gotta help me. I'm going to the llama base to sit down. Yeah. I'm fascinated, fascinated by the bombs passing along here.
Yeah, ha. I gave Leonard a haircut. Yeah, ha. Du, du, du. How come every time we fight a major enemy, its name is shown here? That's weird. Yeah, I guess it is. You already commented on that when you uh, substituted for the exclamation point, though. I don't know why you would now suddenly think it's weird. Oh man, the Great Llama is turned a few degrees. You've probably heard Weber tell you of a Bobolay sauce packet coming alive and flying out the window. You probably also think he's crazy. Well, it turns out that several witnesses witnessed the event, and I myself can see it with my telepathic powers. The Bobolay sauce packet wants to be referred to as the Bobolay God, and it is armed and dangerous with a magical spear. But the Bobolay God is the least of our worries now. Mac Daddy's henchman, a fat kid known only as Orchard, has sent us a message saying that he has invented a special plant called the Pod, which can make evil clones of people. He says that if you try to attack him, he will make clones of the llamas. But we have no choice. We must lead the llamas to Orchard and defeat him. Oh, I just remembered. If you are unlucky enough to encounter the Bubbly God during your travels, you would better watch out. I have no idea where this bobbly god idea came from i mean i used to take lunchables to school and they there were pizza lunchables that included like a weird little dough uh crust thing and a bobbly sauce packet and i don't know some other stuff and obviously i got the idea for the sauce packet from there, but why I made it anthropomorphic, I don't remember. Yeah, yeah, bobbly bobbly pow pow pow. When bobbly gods say that, head explodes. Orchard was in my sixth grade class. He's fat, ugly, and disgusting. If you pulled his finger near an open flame, he'd probably explode. Ha, fart jokes. Did you talk to the Great Llama? See, I'm not crazy. It really happened. Eh, bears. You know, I don't care. I'm just gonna run through these guys. Tigers. Oh man, are there gonna be lions next? Check it out. It looks like the screen is connected to the control panel. Freaky, huh? I guess. Oh, no lions. Well, here's my masterpiece of ASCII art. I'm hiding here so I won't get killed. Pretty smart, huh? Sure. Now you shall die, Bobbly God, for I am your very own Josh Wilson. Oh, man. He slurped the sauce out of the Bobbly God. So... Maybe we could start a money-making scheme about get your picture taken with the Bobbly God. So I didn't actually have to do anything at all to win that battle. You're welcome. Oh, I forgot about this. Orchard. <laughs> I tried to write Orchard on his shirt, but obviously I ran out of room. Orchard flipped you off with a loose fingernail. Ugh. Orchard's fingernails flew everywhere. That's really gross. Ugh. Ugh, stop saying that. Yeah, so I couldn't fit it on his shirt, so I wrote, I'm too fat for my shirt. And here's more fake RPG stuff. I probably don't need to read all this. We lose some health. Beach shivered nervously. Adam cleaned his glasses. Orchard's bumper sticker fell on the ground. Oh, <laughs> his bumper sticker is the thing that says, I'm too fat for my shirt. It fell on the ground because it was made of text, and there's no way to, uh, well, <laughs> you can't change text into empty space the way you can with solid blocks, which is what I did to make him uh, disappear. And actually, that's probably the case with his pants also, because they're brown, and I don't think you can make anything brown without uh, using the Super Toolkit, unless you did yellow text or something. Yeah, because text 
it becomes white on the darker version of the color that you have selected. I don't know why I'm explaining this, because people who make ZZT games would already know, and nobody else would care, but whatever. Evil Clone Llamas. There's a note from Orchard. I didn't think you'd defeat me, but just in case, I already activated the pod. Here are the evil clone llamas programmed to kill. You! Oh no, which ones are real? Ah, the real Adam was shot. The real Adam fell over. Hey, that hurt. The evil JJ was shot. The evil JJ exploded into bits. I guess clones explode. Hey, that hurt. The real JJ was shot. The evil Adam was shot. The evil Firebrand was shot. The real Firebrand was shot. Okay, so just the the evil beats is left. And he's dead. These games are not very challenging. Black Llama, come here. Now I'm getting excited. Woohoo! Ha 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 ha. When I'm excited, I laugh. Ha 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 ha. Well, ha. Anyway, ha. Leonard is ha ha back. Ha ha. Hoo hoo. Ha ha. He's got a new suit. Ha ha ha. He hates you and he loves your brother Richard. Ha ha ha. Sorry. Ha ha. Where did that ha last part come from? Ha ha ha. This is um ripped off from a uh, Robin Hood Men in Tights. You idiot! Why are you laughing? This is terrible news. I was er trying to um soften the blow. Well, you blew it. Oh, and I noticed that some of you were defeated in the battle with the evil clone llamas. As you can see, I've completely revived them. You're welcome. Anyway, the battle with Leonard will be a fierce one. He has a new suit he calls the Llama Liquor Suit. It has a sensor eye, diode gloves, rocket boots, and underwear. Phew, you said it. Miranda is my arch enemy. When we were both llamas, we used to go out, but then she dumped me and started shooting you. Remember? That's... That happened in the first game. Well, that's why I'm still here. When you find Miranda, I'm going to help whether you like it or not. Whatever we have to do to get rid of her, let's do it. My goal in life is to see Miranda's grave. Wow. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It seems like this mission has been really short. Whoa, whoa. But the war is far from over. I have a feeling that we'll have to face at least five major... Man. Five more major enemies before we can win. I... That can't be the case. There's something else, too. All my life I've wanted to be a disco dancer. The only reason I haven't pursued this dream is because I'm a llama, and I have to stay a llama at least until the end of this mission. Remember when all the llamas were dancing last year? That was really fun. Another reference to the events of the previous game. This is strange. I'm not afraid of getting killed anymore. I guess I've just gotten used to it. Let's go. Alright, I confess. The reason I've been so afraid of getting killed is because my dad was killed by Mac Daddy ten years ago. In fact, now that I think about it, it's been ten years to the day. That's it. I've got to destroy Mac Daddy and avenge my dad's death, or I'll never get over this pukey feeling. Man, it feels like events are coming to a head here. Yeah, 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 ha, 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 roast em, toast em, wah, ha, ha, gotta get a Cadillac. Oops, I mean, I want to get edificated. Smart, strong, fire, cool, gotta go to school, can't cause I'm on mission, dough. I guess I'm setting up all the uh, goals for the characters here, for whatever reason. For some reason I'm hearing a vacuum cleaner in my brain. I think I'm getting homesick. As soon as we finish this mission, I've got to get home. Okay. Oh. I think that is supposed to say Leo the Third, spelled out in the ruffians there. Although some of them seem to be missing. I think I I exceeded the maximum number of ruffians you can have on the screen. Oops. Well, I don't know what that said. I presume I need to get to his heart. Uh. <laughs> Wait, say that again. Oh well. Something about, oh, you, you found my weak spot. You can pause the video and read it, probably. We're sorry, but this bomb machine has been disconnected or is temporarily out of service. Please try your call again later.
It's out of service because you're standing in front of it. Uh, do I care enough to talk to the guys? Probably not. Well, I should. Go away, ruffians. I keep attacking, but it doesn't have any effect at all. Maybe this isn't his weak point after all. Ha! Crotch humor. It's not working. Ugh. Hello? I guess he doesn't say anything. Why are his eyes still moving if he's dead? Oh. I guess he wasn't dead. Ha ha, cough. Ha, you hack fool. Now I will get Hawk Patu rid of you, belch once and for blarg all. Oh, who am I kidding? I couldn't beat you in a million years. Your strength is too much for me. Just go ahead and get killed by Miranda. Hack! Oh, everybody's wandering around. And they don't talk. Okay, whatever. Not so fast. You're not passing through this door unless you let me kill Miranda. Do we have a deal? Uh, I actually don't remember what this does. Sure. A wise choice. Ha 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 ha. Hmm. Don't even try to fight. Remember our deal. Okay. Weber spit out a sticky web. Miranda could not move. Weber bit Miranda with his poisonous fangs. Miranda got poisoned. Weber threw a super bomb. Miranda lost 582 health. Miranda's strength is at its lowest level. Weber threw a kind of super bomb. <laughs> Miranda lost 518 health. Miranda exploded into bits. The bits flew everywhere and hit Weber. <laughs> Weber got hurt and collapsed. Weber is dead. Oh man. How tragic. His desire for revenge was his own undoing. Wow. Worked, actually. It did. Almost to Mac Daddy we are, but me still not smarty pants. I can't believe Weber actually beat Miranda. I feel like dancing, but... Man, so I'm reinforcing that stuff that I just set up a few boards ago. I'm actually kind of surprised that I put that much thought into this. Ah, Miranda just, like, shimmered out of view. That was weird. I want to go home. I mean, not that it's, like, artfully done or anything, but... So, Miranda's dead? Sorry, I didn't see it because I was too caught up in my own daydreams. I was daydreaming about killing Mac Daddy. Okay, this is Mac Daddy. He is based on a teacher that I had in middle school was very fat and gave a lot of pop quizzes. So you finally got here, you poor little baby. I'm on the tear. Watch out for pop quizzes. A sheet of paper, let's begin, please. A sheet of paper. These are all catchphrases of the teacher in question. Okay, let's see what's going on here. I guess I just shoot his head. Ha ha ha, you can't shoot me, Nat Booty, because I don't take no damage. Hmm. Is this another... Yes, it is. <laughs> Where I don't actually have to do anything in the fight. This was probably a poor design choice in retrospect. Mac Daddy attacked with stinky armpits. Scott saw things differently than others. Scott tried the big bar of deodorant that Adam gave him, but it didn't work very well. Maybe he was hallucinating, but Scott thought he saw the spirits of Weber, Miranda, and Leonard. This is Leonard. I used to be a llama, but I was expelled. I would like to rejoin the llamas, but I can't, because I'm dead, mostly. But I will still help the llamas in this battle. I will use my powers against Mac Daddy. It's me, Miranda, and I just want to say that... Even though I hate the llamas, I will still help you defeat Mac Daddy. I'm only doing it because I used to go out with Josh. 
See, Mac Daddy is the source of my evilness. If I can destroy him, maybe I can turn back into a good guy. Being evil is fun, except I always lose. Maybe I'll have better luck as a good guy. I guess I was using the gender neutral uh, form of guy there. It's me, Weber. I got killed when I was beating up Miranda, but now I'm back alive, except I'm dead. Cool, huh? Well, anyway, I'm going to kill Mac Daddy. So, they destroyed him. Yeah, nobody talks anymore. I guess I was getting tired of making the game at this point. Wow, the Great Llama's so happy. Woohoo, you beat Mac Daddy again. Yes, yes, woohoo, cha-ching, ooh, oh, 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 oh. Uh, I think that was supposed to be oh, 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 oh. Maybe, I don't know. Sweet, that rocks. Here we go. That's the way, uh-huh, uh-huh, I like it. Goodness gracious, great balls of fire. Yeah, 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 yeah. A baby, 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 a daddy, 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 umph, all oh, yeah. Okay, I'm finished. Go in the passages to see each character's endings. Go in the gray passage last. Okay. Let's see Adam's ending. Oh, he's dancing. Check out that awesome disco ball effect. I, I really liked water. The way, uh, that's water inside the disco ball there because it flashes and I thought it looked cool. It's fun to stay at the YMCA. YMCA, hey. Oh, hi. Now that we beat Mac Daddy, I have spare time to dance. Woohoo, YMCA. Oh, beats. Rip, beats is pop. A path that's cleared through the forest. God, I hate those default messages. Gee, this tombstone is bigger than I remember it. Oh well, the point is Mac Daddy is finally dead, so I'm happy. Dad's happy. Cool, huh? Sure. Violence only leads to more violence, dude. Firebrand. The predicate post conjunctulates the verb unless it is preposterous, in which case your participle dangles. That's not real grammatical stuff. Ah, greetings. It is I, Firebrand. You are unable to identify me because I am not speaking the syllable. Yeah, am I correct? As you can see, I have achieved my goal. He's smart now. JJ. That thing is a TV. The, it has stuff that is supposed to say TV on it. Hi, I'm JJ's mom. It seems like JJ has been kind of restless since he got home. Oh well. By the way, did I tell you I'm going to inherit the earth? That's right, because I'm meek. Ha ha ha. have no idea why she says that, but it amuses me. So, Good job past me on amusing the me of the present. Well, I finally got home. Yep, yep. But you know what? I'm bored. Irony. I'm one of JJ's sisters. I'm one of JJ's sisters. <laughs> I like that that's how they uh, identify themselves. Okay. Oh yeah, in, in case it wasn't obvious, uh, you play as me in this game. Self-insertion. N-M-I-A-O-W. Since you play this guy, you will have to make up your own ending for him. Sorry. That's kind of a cop-out. But I guess since I uh, didn't have any backstory, there wasn't really any ending that would make any sense. Oh. And the cast. Mm. Yeah. Not much to say about that. Credits. Um, do, do, ba, da, 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 ba, ba, da. Oh yeah, guy who can't pronounce Maj Soft. For the record, that is how it was always intended to be pronounced. Maj Soft. Do, 
Wow, Jessamine was a beta tester on this? It... Huh, I don't remember that. Okay, well, that was it. Uh, kind of anticlimactic at the end there, but, uh... Yeah. Bye.